Hey guys, and today we're back on to another video, and today we're going to be watching, oh no, like reacting, well it's not really a reaction video, today we're going to be finding out what PD character am I, personality test made by Cameron the Weirdo. So, uh, let's get started. So I saw this video on YouTube, and I thought it would be a pretty cool idea if I made a video on me finding out which piggy character am I. Okay, so, uh, let's get started. So... I already watched a bit of it, so if we, like, skip ahead, here are the instructions of it. Here's how this will work. I'll ask a series of questions. Each answer gives you a certain amount of points. You'll need a calculator, notes, a pen and paper, or some way to keep track of your points. I have my phone over here, which has a calculator on it. There's no right answer to the questions. They're all personal to you. Example, I ask, do you prefer outside or inside? Answer A would be inside, answer B would be outside, and then you can just read the rest. A certain answer choice gives you points, and you're not trying to aiming to get the most points, you're just trying to find your character. Alright, so, uh, let's get started. Okay, so here we go. I'm just gonna go ahead and skip ahead a bit, because we already read the instructions. Okay, um, hello? Please, let me see the questions, I'm begging of you. Okay, I have my calculator right here. Let's get started. Okay, um, what's the first question? Okay, what month were you born in? Okay, so, uh... For the people that don't know yet, my birthday is on February 20th, so, uh, I'm born in February, yeah, February 20th, 2-0, yeah. Okay, so that's the month I am born in. I'm not saying the year, because then you guys could calculate how old I am, and then the, the end result will shock you. Okay, uh, okay, so, uh, if you were born in December, January, or February, you get... 40 points, so I'm just gonna put 40 on my calculator right now, okay, so there you go, 40 points so far, alright, I wonder where this is going, and also, what does the month you were born in have to do with your piggy character, like, I thought this was a personality test, what does, what month you were born do, do with personality, what the heck, okay, what's your favorite season, okay, so, uh, I actually like summer the most, because first of all, there's no school, and I get to play video games all day, so, uh, yeah, summer, I guess. Oh, great, I only got 10 points, wow. Okay, uh, 1, 0, okay, 50. And yeah, I think I prefer summer out of all the other seasons, because it's like, it's the mo it's like the most relaxing season, and people say they hate summer because of how hot it is, just stay inside, like, you get to have so much fun in the summer, no school, I love it, okay, so yeah. Some people prefer fall because it's, like, not too hot, not too cold, I've heard some people say, but I prefer summer. Okay, here we go. So, that's the second question. So far, I have 50 points because 40 plus 10, 50. Okay, what is your favorite color? Okay, is this even a question? If you go and look at my profile picture right now, most of the colors are consisted of blue and green. So, uh, yeah, blue or green. Those are my two favorite colors out of all of them. I think that's mostly everyone's favorite color. I, I'm guessing, like, blue or green. Some people might choose red or orange. Okay, uh, so, uh, since my favorite colors are blue and or green, I get 30 points, so 50 plus 30 is 80. Okay, I just have a calculator here just in case because I don't want to struggle with calculating my points. Okay, here we go. Let's continue on. Okay, we have 80 points so far. Okay, what superpower would you have? Okay, Super strength or super speed, invisibility or shape shifting, laser eyes or reading minds. Okay, that's definitely Dude Man right there. Laser eyes or reading minds, flight or teleportation. Hmm, that kind of reminds me of Georgie in PGHL Films as RP films. Invisibility or shape shifting. I'm stuck between these two. Hold on. Invisibility or shape shifting or flight or teleportation. Well, uh. I think I'm gonna go with flight or teleportation. I feel like if I had one of these superpowers, I'd be happy with it. Like, if I could fly, I'd be happy. If I could teleport, I'd be happy. So, uh, yeah. So, flight or teleportation. Okay, uh, let's skip the timer because we literally just paused the video. Okay, uh, great, we get another 10 points. I don't know if Cameron the Weirdo is trolling with me over here, but we get another 10 points. Okay, so far we have 90 points. I literally have my calculator right here, and it says I have 90. Okay. What do you do in your free time? Okay, now it's getting a bit personal. I hang out with my friends, I get into trouble, I play sports and go outside, I'm mostly online. Okay, so, uh, I don't have any friends. <laughs> Why is that even funny? I don't have any friends, I, I'm not the troublemaker, 
and I'm not really an active guy. I'm mostly online. I mostly just make videos and stay inside the house. I don't have friends. I don't get into trouble. I don't go and do physical activity outside for my free time. It says, what do you do in your free time? Like, what do you enjoy and what do you, like, most likely do? I'm mostly online. Like, I'm mostly just making videos, checking out, like, other YouTube videos. Yeah, I'm mostly online. Yeah, I'm just that type of guy. Okay. Um, let's skip it. Okay. So, uh... Mostly online gets 30 points, so 90 plus 30 is 120. Okay, here we go. Alright, so let's continue on. Okay. So, uh, choose a pet. Okay. So, uh, this might get a little controversial, but, uh, dinosaur and hamster are off the list, okay? Like, first of all, how would I house a dinosaur? And hamsters are pretty too small, and they're kind of hard to take care of. So not leave the dog and kitten. Now, uh... You know when someone asks you, are you a dog or a cat person, stuff like that? Well, uh, I prefer cats more than dogs. I don't know. I, I, I've just spent more time with cats in my life than dogs. And won't you look at that? Cats get 30 points, while dogs only get 20 points. Okay, I'll happily add 30 points to my score. I bet half of you already unsubscribed to me because, like, I chose cats over dogs. It's not my fault, okay? It's just, I've spent more time with cats than dogs in my life. Like, I've had more cats than dogs in my life. Like, y you know what I mean? Like, I've had more experience, experience, haha, <laughs> I said it, experience with cats more than dogs. Yeah, this is sort of like a Q&A for me right now, except we're trying to find out our piggy character. How many more questions? Okay. You can only save one person from the infection. Okay, so, uh, we have Pet. Um, yeah, goodbye, Pet. I, I'm sorry, uh, Kitten, I, I, I salute you, but, uh, I don't think I, I'll cure you if there's an infection. Friend? Okay, first of all, if I had to cure a friend, my first question in mind would be, like, how did I even get that friend? Okay, let's pretend this is Jaden. Okay, let's pretend the friend option is Jaden, because, uh, Jaden is, uh, like, my Roblox friend. Will I cure Jaden, myself, or a family member? Like, my mom, dad, or my brother? So, will I cure Jaden, myself, or a family member? I cure a family member, because family is more important than anything, even myself. And, Jaden, I'm sorry, if my family is even more important than Jaden. I hope Jaden is not watching this video, because he'd be so mad. Okay, I'd cure a family member, because family is important. So yeah, I'd cure a family member. Skip it. I only get 10 points for curing a family member. Come on, Cameron the Weirdo. I just care for my family. Is that too hard to ask? You get 30 points for curing your friend? 40 points for curing yourself? Okay. Have you ever snuck out of the house? Okay, I've never snuck out of the house. I swear I have never snuck out of the house. Nope. You get 20 points if you have snuck out of the house. Really? Okay, I'm gonna just put 10 points here. Okay, I have never snuck out of the house in my life. I don't know why people do that. I don't know what they want to do, but I've never snuck out of the house in my entire life. Okay, here we go. Um, so I only got 10 points. Uh, have you subscribed to Cameron the Weirdo? Uh, um, uh, oh no. Oh no, I've been, um, um, uh. Uh, yeah, I, I'm totally subscribed to Cameron the Weirdo. Yeah, yes, yes, I am subscribed to Cameron the Weirdo. Why is this even a question to find out who piggy character I am? Yes, I'm definitely subscribed. It's not like I just subscribed right then. Yeah, okay, I get 10 points. I, I only get 10 points for subscribing? No, I'm taking my subscriber back. Okay, I'm just kidding. Okay, um... 10 points. I now have 180 points. I think I calculated something wrong, but who knows. Alright. I have t I got 10 points because I subscribed to Cameron the Weirdo. Do you support piggy ships? Okay, I have a question. What do any of these questions have to do with finding out my piggy character? Okay, uh, do you support piggy ships? No. I do not support piggy ships. I think they're cursed. Just really cursed. Why are they even in the piggy community? Yes! Finally, I get 20 points from that. I now have 200 points. Ha! Yeah, do you support piggy ships? I'm sorry for the people that actually do. I do not support piggy ships. I feel like 10 people have already sub unsubscribed from my channel already. Oh god, what am I doing? Okay. Tally up your points because it's time to see your character. Okay, so... You can't see me right now because I don't have a webcam, but on my calculator, it says I have 200 points. 200. Zero, zero. So let's go and see who my character is. But first, let's see what my character could have been. 
If you scored 100 to 120, you're Z. You tend to be quite shy person. You're not very talkative, but you're very smart. You're very kind, but not over the top. You're the quiet kid. If you scored 121 to 140, you're giraffe. You're very caring, you're kind, and very civil. You solve situations to love helping others. You're very classy and thoughtful. Your friends think highly of you, and overall, you're pretty cool. Okay. I'm not giraffe. If you scored 141 to 170, you're Mimi. Okay, you're smart. You're very smart. Your friends probably think you're the most intelligent in your friend group. You tend to be very nice and helping. You help others when they need without a question. You're a very nice and smart post person. If you scored 171 to 200, you're Pony. Um, okay. You are possibly a simp for a girl who wears pink. Okay, okay, just because I'm Pony doesn't mean I simp for Zizzy Cameron, okay? Just because I scored 200 points on this quiz doesn't mean I simp for a girl who wears pink. That's what Pony does. I do not do that. I, I, I just want to make that clear out there. I do not simp for anyone, okay? You're very kind, and there's not many people that like you. True. You're very de de dedicated to keeping people safe and helping them, but sometimes you desire to help people. You desire to help people takes over and puts you in danger. Okay, so that's who I am, guys. Okay, is there any more ranks that are higher than 200? Let's see who I could have been if I scored like one more point, because uh, I got 200 and the last point of 200. If you score 201 to 240, you're Zizzy. You're a fighter, you have a pure, kind soul, and you're a fighter. When your friends is being hurt or in danger, you will stick up for them. You're kind, caring, and a warrior uh, who will protect all people you care about. 240 to 270. You're Mr. P. You have a very pure heart, and you're very kind. Your intentions may be pure, but sometimes determination can cause you to cre create chaos accidentally. Sometimes you go overboard and create destruction, a positive of your original goal. Okay, if you go 271 to 290, you're budgy. You are not the most trustable person, sure. Sometimes your attentions are pure, but you lie to get what you want. Sometimes you'll tell a few fibs to just get things your way. Okay, if you score 290 to 310, you're Willow. You're slick. You're sly. You sometimes let violence or evil get in the way of your intentions. Determination and past events can really get you worked up and cause you to burst out. Okay, so 290 to 310, you're Willow. So whoever made it that far, congratulations. You're a criminal. Okay, if you score 311 to 340, you're Tio. You're just evil, lol. Deal with it. Wow. Cry about it. <laughs> okay, I think that's gonna be it for the video. So, yeah, guys. Is there any more ranks? Okay, maybe if this video gets 500 likes, I'll do a part 2. And more edited, less rushed part 2. Okay, so, yeah, guys. That's gonna be it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. This was me finding out which piggy character are you. And in this video, I found out that I'm Pony. I'm- I'm not a simp that simps for a girl. I- I do not simp for anyone. That's what Pony does. Uh, this first sentence, you are possibly a simp for some girl who wears pink, but probably not. This sentence is not true. I do not simp for anybody. You're very kind, and there's not many people like- that like you. You're very dedicated to keeping people safe and helping them, but sometimes you- your desire to help people takes over and puts you in danger. Yeah. So I guess I'm Pony. It's my desire to help people- takes over and puts me in danger, I'm very dedicated to keeping people safe, apparently. Th this first sentence, no, that is not true. Yeah, but you're very kind and there's not many people that like you. Yeah, that's sort of true, I kind of agree with that, sort of, like 50%. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed seeing me rage over the fact that I'm a horse. Literally a horse. Yeah, I'm Pony. There you go, guys. I am not a simp. I am not a simp. How dare you, Pony? You put me in the spot. How dare you? Okay, so yeah, guys. Thanks for watching, and, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go talk to Pony for a second. Hey, uh, Pony, can I ask you something? Yeah, sure. What's up? Do you simp for a girl that has a purple dress? Uh, no! <laughs> what are you talking about? Hmm. You're looking a little sus there, Pony. Bum, bum, bum!